Hello folks and it's me Accidental Antelope doing a quick video on how to do the Stellaris um, Star Wars mod and how to set up your Stellaris game so that you can run it so obviously open your Steam folder and you open Stellaris now you need to check what version you got so I'm just going to quickly do this before I go into Steam itself so you can see it's a bit complicated because this mod has not yet been updated for um, 1.6 version of Stellaris. So if you want to play it and you're fully updated with your Stellaris game, you will need to roll back. And it's not quite as easy as it seems. Okay, so as you can see here, I've got it on Banks 1.5.0, which is the one you need. So I'm going to open Steam, I'm going to show you the bits where you need to do because Stellaris is currently on 1.6.1 which was a hotfix that was added to the game recently. So I'm just opening my main Steam panel, second, I don't know why it's taking so long, there we go. Dota, I don't care about Dota. Right, so it was Stellaris, um, right click on it, like that. Open properties, go to betas here, and you can select which version you run. So if you select 1.5.0, that's fine, but that's the one you select. And then it will do the download for you, and it, when you relaunch Stellaris, it will um, it will be on the correct version of the game. Then, to get the Star Wars mod itself, um, Best thing you could do is, yep, community workshop. That search for a workshop. Put in Stellaris. There we go. Now if you go to most subscribe, no, no. Okay, it's not in the top one, so go with a Galaxy Divide, like so. And here it is. Nope, that's the Galactic Empire. This is the one I'm playing, a Galaxy Divided. To come through and that's fine and all you have to do is hit the subscribe button and it will download the data normal way through the steam launcher um. Click some cutter. Yep. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> get distracted by all the notes. So you do that. You've downloaded the Steam Workshop. You've downloaded the correct version of Stellaris, so you can then go into Stellaris itself. go and all you do is when you come over here you make sure Star Wars Galaxy Divided is highlighted and it will allow you to launch the game as long as you've done everything I said before correctly you'll start getting shots like this when you load it up instead of the original Stellaris ones It will take a bit longer to load up when you mess around with the stuff in the actual file. Ok, 
Come on! You know you want to. Okay. And there we go. And you will get this screen if you have done it correctly. So, that's it. Thank you for watching. I hope this helps if anyone's having problems with it. And um, I'll see you in game. Bye.